Hi, and welcome to Antelope Valley Schools Transportation Agency, or AVSTA, Safety and Training Video Series. Each video will cover specific areas of workforce training and compliance regulations, and can be viewed in part or in whole as part of our ongoing commitment to facilitate employee safety, productivity, and knowledge. This is Antelope Valley Schools Transportation Agency training on the revised hazardous material identification labels. OSHA requires AVSTA and other agencies to educate and inform their employees about hazardous materials they may be exposed to. The new labeling system is a revision of OSHA's hazard communication standards as an international standardized approach to label elements and safety data. Quoting U.S. Secretary of Labor Hilda Solis, exposure to hazardous chemicals is one of the most serious threats facing American workers today. Revising OSHA's hazard communication standard will improve the quality and consistency of hazard information, making it safer for workers to do their jobs and easier for employers to stay competitive. The Hazard Communication Standard, HCS, is now aligned with the Globally Harmonized System of Classification and Labeling of Chemicals, or GHS. I'm going to walk you through each of the nine GHS labels, their wording category, and their potential hazard associations. At the end of the video, there will be a short quiz for compliance records. Please feel free to review sections as necessary. So, let's get started. Our first symbol is GHS 1100, skull and crossbones. Hazards associated with this symbol are acute toxicity, either fatal or toxic. Our second symbol is GHS 1101, environment label, indicating aquatic toxicity. Our third symbol is GHS 1102, gas cylinder, indicating gases under pressure. Our fourth symbol is GHS 1103, exploding bomb, indicating explosives, self-reactives, and organic peroxides. Our fifth symbol is GHS 1104, exclamation mark. This symbol can indicate a variety of hazards, including skin and eye irritant, skin sensitizer, acute toxicity, narcotic effects, respiratory tract irritant, and hazardous to the ozone layer. Our sixth symbol is GHS 1105, flame label. This symbol indicates hazards such as flammables, pyrophorics, self-heating, emits flammable gas, self-reactives, and organic peroxides. Our seventh symbol is GHS 1106, flame over circle which indicates oxidizers. Our eighth symbol is GHS 1107, health hazard, indicating carcinogen hazard, mutagenicity, reproductive toxicity, respiratory sensitizer, target organ toxicity, and aspiration toxicity. Our ninth and final symbol is GHS 1108, corrosion, indicating a hazard potential of skin corrosion or burns, eye damage, and corrosive to metals. Next, we have a short paper quiz to help reinforce a training session. Thank you for your participation in today's training session. AVSTA is fully committed to the safety and well-being of all of our employees.